And here's my re last review of Eh, hell, if I have any more, I want to review and review them today. It doesn't take that long. Of animated ratchet. I'm not going to use the tools because they aren't so accurate. And they're just crap. They decided to bring with the figure. But anyhow, um, this is his ambulance mode. It doesn't do anything. That's pretty so accurate. Um, translucent thing here. Painted. Translucent. Translucent. Painted. And silver Autobot logo. Better control them all because I have nothing better to do. Um, doesn't do much. Um, but first you're gonna want to start by taking this back section, pulling it down till it kind of locks semi. Not really. You'll unlock later. And then you're gonna wanna take the legs, put them at a good angle. Then get your nail in this thing here. Crud. Flip it out. Okay, release camera, and now we have an ambulance without back wheels and leg, and, but it does shit. not get a good position today. Alright, that's what I have to do. We want to take this part, put it up, bend it forward, and then you're going to want to extend the arms. I don't think they've ever done that before, and open them. Extend them, open them. Rotate them 180 degrees so that the magnet's up. Then you're going to want to uh, take this, that whole thing, and move it forward to it's right there. Same thing with the other side. And flip this flap around and see that big inlet side. And you're going to want to bend this in so it looks a little more balanced. Alright, stand them up now. Um, bend it down, bend it down, the arms down. And the next thing you're going to want to do, there's a button here. And if you bring this down, ching, spring and ratchet head. It's a bit wobbly of a place, but you get the point. Side, etc., etc. In robot mode, he's pretty show accurate. Forward, backward, uh, 90 degrees at the knee. Hip rotates, puts the rotation at the knee. Picking on the other side, on 360, 90, except when you go full 90. Magnet flips forward, and it's only half a magnet. Uh, magnet things, and they aren't so accurate, but how are you going to make magnets fall out of a guy's arm? Um, guess you can do the same thing with the other side. I don't have Lockdown's EMP, but it does fit in there. Or rather, Ratchet's EMP. He does have light piping, and he also has the battle damage on the thing over there. Um, it, it, it isn't painted in there or anything, but it's good to have the damage and the ability to do that. Um, 360. Ugh, oh, good. Ugh, oh, pardon. Really long day. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, I guess, um, I'll compare him in robot. Oh, shit. In robot mode. Ugh, oh, robot mode. Um, here's my bumblebee. On the show, Ratchet is much taller than Bumblebee, but here, Bumblebee's only about a uh, head shorter. Classics, Bumblebee, and it's a lot shorter. Andrew John's Sky Blast, dang, that's short. And Classics, Rodimus. Not that tall. And then the last uh, comparison is going to be on animated bulkhead. Boom, Stanley Ranch is taller than. Okay. But in a review, we can call this an animated ratchet review.